What is going on guys? It's me Liquid Truth and welcome back to our SFO Thorgrim Grudgebearer Let's Play. Things are looking rather dicey right now. Last episode, we destroyed the Slaves of Tsar's main stack. They tried to sneak it through the mountains. We took them down, but now I'm kind of wondering what to do because they have nine settlements. They have no strength rank right now, but we obviously cannot really make it over there because we are getting gang banged by Clan Moors. So we're about to have to deal with this battle. Level 21 chieftain. No need my warp token stash. But Yeah, as I was pointing out, I'm pretty sure we can beat this with just Thorgrim's army. So Hmm. Oh yeah, and then the bloody hands declared war on us last turn. How many settlements do you have? Two. So yeah, for now I think we're stuck down here. But we will reevaluate if we can deal with the slaves of Tsar in a little bit. And we have a little bit of money, but I don't know what we would want to upgrade. Not that. Controls okay here. Hmm. I'm thinking about that. Hmm. No, we'll wait, we'll wait. So first, we have Thorgrim. I mean, I guess we just go for the weakest guy first. Makes the most sense. Hmm. I forgot we could, of course, lightning strike them, so beautiful. So yeah, we're going to fight this manually, obviously. And I'll see you guys on the battlefield, because we just have to deal with this. So awesome. All right, let's get cracking. So luckily, we outrange them. And we have explosive damage on our artillery. Let's see. It comes up to here. Actually, we'll stick around this so they can't completely flank us. So yeah, there are plate claw catapults in there. So if we do that, we can start able to hit theirs. Hmm going to do this. Go like that. Because we need to be able to hit their poison wind mortars. So we have that. Every mm. Hammers are still banged up, so we'll just keep you on the back. Let's see. Line of sight's not too bad. So we'll put you there. Beards. 
Thunderous. And then put you guys back there. War of vengeance, dwarf warriors. Thunderous. Shocks away, Dal. No, yeah, that's fine. Thunderous! Wait, you man, blood! For the ancestors! Right. That should be fine. That's it. Let's go. Nothing can stop us! Yeah, we're just focusing on the poison wind mortars, obviously. Raging target! Stuck! Yes, Lord! No shoddy contraptions here! Yes! And then we'll try to flashbang him. Or flash bomb. Pretty much a damn flashbang. Let's be honest. Can stop us. All right. Charge! Charge! Oh no, I'm shooting the damn Off wrong ones. The arcs. And then. Right. Oh, you can't give him armor piercing damage? Giant That's fine. We're here to drop Francis. bombs, though. And you're bunched up. We'll do. Mm -mm -mm. All right, now we'll just get them back over here. Damn. Leave my miners alone. Boost your melee defense and stats. And then we'll just have you snipe the lords. Okay, cool. Let's be about this for the devil's crown. Fight! Fire! Reload! Yeah, come drop Fire! bombs on this. Crush thrower! Go, go, go. Damn, they keep trapping me. For the ancestors! Yeah, that's not going good for you, dude. I'll get you out of there. And then we'll send you. Just do a little bombing. Make sure everybody else is safe. Miners got banged the hell up, but beautiful. Hell yeah, first victory. Well, first victory of the episode, I mean. See you guys back on the map. Cool. So we didn't lose anything. Mm, I think we're in our own province. But 950 oath gold. Or 950 gold and 20 oath gold is pretty good. Enemy killed in battle. Both of them. Oh my god. Skyhammer, Gyro Bomber. And we solved the grudge. For the wisdom of Valea. Hell yeah. Shout out Valea. She'd be hooking it up. Retake the realms. Now we will go for. Oh, 
oh my god vigor loss reduction for the whole army absolutely absolutely perverse another point boosting our cannons range ammunition and missile damage and we'll start going for our flame cannon, even though we don't have one just yet. Yes! Oh, I can't reach him. Time for a reckoning. Mm. The throng agrees. Move. I think we'll do that to catch him hopefully because you're good with health right now i think i want to get a runesmith one of these buildings down here yeah because we don't have a runesmith yet and we really need one in the army up cheaper upkeep for lords and heroes weapon strength when fighting greenskin ogres and skaven all units in army Welcome done. aboard, my boy. Give him the rune of speed, and then... Rune of oath and steel. Because mostly he's here to buff our other units. Because right now we have some good explosive damage and stuff. So next we have our boy here. With an even easier army. The only annoying unit he has is this. They're still not, not. higher strength rank than us. Damn, I'm glad we went to war with them before they became allies with Korn. Damn. Yeah, how are we supposed to fight the slaves of Tsar? This is going to be... We're going to be stuck on this mountain. Like... How the hell am I supposed to deal with these clowns? Do you guys have any advice for that? Because we obviously do not have enough money to field another army. Um, Maybe we move him over here, but he doesn't really have the strength to solo all of the Slaves of Zara's stuff, I don't think. Uh, but I guess we send him out and hope for the best. So, enough chitter chatter. I declare war on them. Ooh, nice try. Strength. Close victory. Well, we'll see about that. Yeah, this is the only unit I'm quote unquote worried about. And the chieftain. The chieftain and them are both pretty. pretty nice so we need to be careful and watch them like, look at these fucking abilities dude damn so yeah i'll see you guys on the battlefield mm. we'll keep this layout but we will move over here because yeah now they don't have play clock catapult We'll put you there. Find your targets for the Karazanko. Thunderous. Hmm. Vengeance. Death. Kill X. It is a reckoning. I want them in the middle. Miners. With miners right next to them. Kazook. Ready. And then the, the thunderers on the sides of them. Quarrelers. I don't think they're gonna flank me this time. Come 
Hammers still a little banged up. Yeah, that's fine. Vengeance. Shadow Bomber. You hit them. You hit them. We'll go obviously straight for the plague monk sensor bears. We need you to just try to focus the lords. Beautiful. So much for your plague monks. And now we can actually shift the tension over there. Bombing run. Understood, Lord. Move now. Has it? Dino bomber. Yeah. Oh. He's almost in range. Oh, he's good. Fly. Got him. Stop. Oh, is that a howling warp gale? Damn, we can't move. But if they're gonna run under us, we can bomb them. boost everybody's ah, range and accuracy and then we'll get you guys out of the way yes. I'll do it. Nothing can stop us. Damn. Homie's just making a mess. You please light him up. Hammers. You. Come drop some bombs over here. Make sure these guys are dead, please. You get out of the way. make sure these lords also die because you guys are causing too much damn havoc I'm pretty sure they did but I'm gonna make sure the rest of you die too jerks hell yeah I'll take it damn dude they were kind of powerful. But we pulled it off. We're going to get the oath gold and the normal gold. Retake the road. And his army is now destroyed. In March stance, though, we still can't reach anything, so. Hmm. To the Karazan Corps. That'll spread control and stuff. Control, growth, less corruption. No. We'll just head back this way. Leave you there. See, so yeah, our strength rank went. The strength rank went down because we obviously got a little 
too banged up. Now I'm wondering if we should get this for additional casualty replenishment. Yes. I mean, it's a lot of gold. Oh, does it just last forever? I thought it was like a temporary thing. Oh. Uh, yeah, I might do this then. We don't have Everguard units just yet. Hmm. I think I'm gonna do it, guys. We've established our first decree. So now we get a little extra. All right. We're not going to do that. No. I think I'll do that for now. Because I just want to make sure that's well defended so they don't come down and recap it. And we'll leave it at that. Ah, I'm scared. Like I was saying earlier, at this point in all my other playthroughs, like I think we're all at episode 10 on all of them. And the other ones, this is where I'm starting to like, <laughs> yeah, finally get comfortable. But in this one, I'm just like, oh, fuck. So they didn't spot my ambush, so they both moved a little closer, which is awesome. Very cocky. But they still have quite a bit of military strength, so I'm a little worried about where their big army is. Leave my technology alone. Why is he down here? Where are you all the way down here, dude? Grudge issued. Use a hero to successfully perform an action against... Okay. Hmm. Are these jerks just up here messing with my shit? Strength rank slowly climbing back up. And of course... He thinks we're his main enemy. Dude. <laughs> me. Fuck off, dude. We're not messing with you. Why do you want to come mess with us? We need to get... Mm. Cheaper construction cost for infrastructure. For war. You will pay for your follies. The Prince of Dragons swears it. Damn. For the wisdom of Valea. Hmm. What? And what can the Dowie do for you? City Commander. Lord. Ready. Hmm. Yeah, I don't think it's smart to confederate them. At least not now. Ready? Malaya's will binds me to you. Onward! Shout out Valeya. Yes. What is their strength rank? Do not Oh, it went down a little bit. Well, it went down quite a bit because they were like 20 something, and now time. they are. Time for a reckoning. 75. My axe thirsts for war. We're gonna up that because we need to. to. We need this as defensible as possible. But now my question is, do I come in 
for replenishment. Because if I attack him, he's probably going to run. You're probably going to take Crooked Fang Fort. So I think in that case... Hmm. So they do have a military presence. Nine units, you say. There's another Skaven settlement there. The wisdom of Valaya. I mean, we'll need to take that eventually, but yeah, maybe we send him to start scrounging that way. We march. We'll just make sure you're in reinforcement range. What? Pretty sure we already uh -huh. checked all this. Cafe at top. Ah, <sighs> still fighting for our lives here, boys. Does it ever end? Mm. All right. We end the turn. So he saw the ambush. Now they're just headed towards my other settlement. He better take the Crooked Fang Fort. Like he better. Pretty sure he ran away. What the hell, dude? That was not the plan. Yes. <laughs> Onward. Let us begin. No one says no. I mean, yeah, I'll race you over there. Not my fault. To war. Well, no, we can't really. As the High King commands. <laughs> Damn. Send me to vengeance. Hmm. My axe thirsts for war. By the grudge bearer's will. No, no trophies today. Mm. Go then. Agreed. Accept the runes. We'll do it that way. No. Nice, sneaky Never little thought. bitch. <laughs> then we'll see if they'll let us get him. I'm sure he's going to run away. Yeah. Who could have saw that coming? Good. Grimnir's axe thirst. But I don't think he can attack that next turn. What? So that's... Good? Question mark? I don't know. Hmm... We don't have the money to do that. Because we need to add walls here next turn. Ah, fuck.
Queek himself, huh? Oh, you got a dwarf gouger. That's not very nice. What would you need something like that for, Queek? Killing dwarfs? Alright, well, we'll teach him a lesson, and I'll see you guys on the battlefield. Alright. I'm still trying to find the optimal setup here. Because, like I said, this is my first... Well, no, I did uh, Grom Brindle playthrough a while ago, but I don't have a ton of dwarf experience, so I'm still wondering what the best play is. Um... War of vengeance. Dwarf warriors. I think... I think the play is fighting them on that. So we're going to have to run up and reposition up here. So let's see. Yeah. Front line here. Hammers back to health. Whoa. I'm glad I moved here. Uh, hold on. Who has Vanguard? What the hell do they have going on? Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, my God. Okay. I would have lost us that battle immediately. Holy shit. Well, that's not the plan anymore. Fire on your command. Lord of mercy. Do it like that. Thunderous. Minus. Hmm. No. Ancestors. Ugh. Like I said, I'm still trying to find out the best setup for our our boys here. Because they need line of sight. For the ancestors. Long beards. Dwarf warriors. Hmm. War of vengeance. For the ancestors. And then Dwarf Warriors Power Fire Undimmed Dwarf Warriors Yeah, and I just gotta keep eyes on everything the vengeance begin. and hope to Hideo Kojima everything goes according to plan. I've so let's go already summoning shit let us a reckoning. No well, let's go straight for queek preparing bombing run. mr dwarf gouger what kind of shit is that that ain't very cool there's nothing i can fix makes it sound like you hate dwarves and that ain't very cool That'll do. we can't have that Run over this, please. Excuse me. Drop a little bombs. We'll also drop bombs. Drop some bombs. You guys know the drill. Oh, 
Hmm. Nothing can stop us. See if that works. It is a reckoning. Get a volley off, please. Or just back up a little bit. No, catch them, please. Lose everything. Yeah, get your get your help over here, please. You just slow quick. Die bomb. Scuff for the ancestors. You will just have you help over here. Thunderous. Fire on the bow. Range far, range fast. Thorgrim's doing fine. We have two more bombs. We'll use them liberally right here. Beautiful. Then we'll make sure we're back here. We're back here helping Thorgrim. Let's start shooting. Quarrelers. There is no greater authority. Ready to serve. Just make sure you're still back there. Yeah, the line of fire thing is a bit of a nuisance. Okay, beautiful. That's what we needed the whole time. Now I'll set you guys like that. Catch them. Sheesh. All right. The head taker has fallen. And it was a decisive victory. Hell yeah. See you guys back on the map. Hell yeah. And in the loading screen, there was something about... Um... Something Nodwell, some Skaven Lord that was feeding Queek as a child dwarf meat. Queek used to eat dwarf meat? What the fuck, my dude? That is not... That's not okay. Um, look at the gold. Oh, almost. Yes. Yes. And now your buddy's right next to us. I think we're in our own province. But we'll take the gold and oath gold. Is he gonna run away? Nope, because he's stuck there. He used all his movement range. Nice. Oh shit. Wurzag. I knew it was a matter of time. God damn it, dude. Is there ever a moment of peace around here? Oh my god, he stole my technology. Leave us the fuck alone. Oh my god. For the wisdom of Valaya. Runesmith. We'll do the Rune of Wrath and Ruin. And boost our melee defense even more. Time for the reckoning. And then our engineer. We'll get flash bomb. And the Zoof Bar 42 pounders. Plan scheme is yeah, luckily this idiot didn't see 
our ambush until we can kill this little buddy. Thorgrim, on the other hand. Hmm. Less figure loss. And ancestral grudge. Weapon strength when fighting against greenskins. Get the greenskin scourge out of here. We can't have that kind of shit around here. Um. Is flame cannon mastery? Because I don't really plan on using the bolt throwers. I do not like that unit. Iron rock. Armor faction wide. Hmm. I think we have to get walls though. Because yeah, we still have all these territories. Fucking Wurzak, dude. Alright, well. No, Gracie, never. <laughs> the runes are cast. The Karazan Corps. Damn it. Aye, we will better our cause. Yeah, I don't. I'm trying not to take attrition. March. My axe thirsts and so, for war. My axe thirsts for war. Well, if I do that. Do you take me I won't have the movement range to come back and try to set up Wurzak. Which, yeah, he has a pretty simple army. But if we can get him the fuck out of here. Obviously, that would rule. So that's going to be the plan for now. Hmm. Harmony. Low what? Ready. Yes. Son of a bitch. Um. Oh shit, I didn't realize how far this went down. Oh damn, these are super expensive. Mm. Okay. Yeah, I think we picked the most useful one for now. So, we wait. You fail, failed. By the Grudge Bearer's will. I mean, he's gonna have to run this way anyway. Shoulder axes, lads. We so move. we're gonna do that. Because that's on the line of sight. And then, in case he goes there, we don't have to lose this just Anad. just yet. Let us begin. Mm. Yeah, I don't think it's smart to upgrade that just yet. Sadly, I think we've done all we can for now. So we're going to end the turn. See what happens with good old Wurzag over here. I'm sure my ambush is going to be foiled.
Well. I guess it wasn't foiled, but... You sure weren't supposed to get in the way of this. But we're going to do this manually because we need as much health as possible to fight Warzak. But so much for ambushing him. Damn. Now he's probably going to go up north. Fuck. All right. Yeah, we have to do this, though. I thought this was an ambush. I'm so confused. I misunderstood this. They didn't even walk into our ambush. They just <laughs> saw us and were like, yeah, what's up? Let's fight. Mm. For the High King! For a vengeance! Hammerers! Vengeance! So we can obviously make an unbreakable line that they're not going to be able to break. Like they're not going to be able to break either the long beards or the hammers. Like these three will all not break. For the ancestor gods, let the vengeance begin. No! Hmm. The clans unite. Quarrelers. Then we do it like that. For mountain and hall. Yes. There the oath breakers. Four grim grudge bearer. Mm. So you hold them. War you will vengeance. hold over here. Kazook. And then we'll just have you. And if need be, we'll have them flank around. Let's see. All right. I do not like this one bit, but what can yes. you do? I am your high king. What can you do? There's nothing I can fix. Here. This will just get to cause an explosion. Oh my god, they already howling work killed me. For the ancestors. Flash bomb the lord. And yeah, everybody just shoot his ass then. Please shoot them. You guys shoot them. We'll move. And then we'll try to get some bombs on this. They have wronged us. Let the vengeance begin. I Mm. Oh, I completely missed. Trying to make sure I keep eyes on what's going on over here. So far, so good. Alright, let's get you out of there. Should be enough to stop them. Will do. 
just get a volley off. Should be good enough for them. Explosive damage to the grudge throwers. Oh, I forget when you use that, they can't move. Yes, yes. Move now. I'll just send you back over here. Keep doing bombing stuff. He's gone. Mission success. See you guys back on the map. Cool, so we're still doing pretty good. We're going to get control and growth, because I think we're in our territory now. I believe. But I think he's probably going to go up towards Iron Rock. I have to assume. Like he's going to underway jump. Nope. Okay. I probably don't have movement range to reach him, but... That's better than him going up north. Greeting. Um... One, two, three... Hmm. I want to be defensive allies, but not yet. No, because I don't want to get dragged into those wars. Oh my God, leave our technology alone. Don't, you better not do it too. Get away from me. Enemy killed in battle. Tech researched. Two more turns until the Iron Rock has walls. What? He's in march stance within range. Me if you dare. My dude, you fucked up. You fucked up big time. All right, now let's check. Not that one. And this. Oh, it's going up, so we're fine. Um. I think we're good on that. What? This is good. My axe thirsts for war. So yeah, now we'll start hopping back south. As for a technology to pick. Fuck growth, give me some control. All right, so we'll go for that. And get more tradable resources, and then we can get empower the guilds. Um, Cafe. Yeah. one rug, more head skulls. Damn, he went real far down now. Beautiful, but yes. yeah, we'll probably end it here so it doesn't get too long. Because obviously, when we get back, we are going to fight Warzag because he can't run he's in march stance so Let us begin. beautiful what is his strength rank 25 huh all right well we'll see about that after we run into him and then we might start taking these things 
but I'm not sure. Like I said, I'm just worried about the slaves of Zar hopping over and... Oh, wait, hold on. What did it say? Have the will or ability to hurt you too much. I mean, for now, but if they hop over with a full fucking stack, military presence 11... 11 yeah and we'll upgrade this so yeah we should be all right this i'm not so sure about silver spear i'm tempted to try to sell to them so we can keep our stuff consolidated a little bit until we decide to branch out but i'm not sure so let me know what you guys think in the comments but anyway thank you guys so so much for watching don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to help boost for the algorithm guides. And I'll see you guys next time. Take care.